Are you tired of posting on Instagram just to have your posts flop? Or maybe it feels like your competitors are making worse videos than you, but they're still getting more views and more followers. Well, don't worry, because by the end of this video, you're gonna have seven different algorithm hacks that you can implement today to increase the views that you get on your next post on Instagram. In fact, this creator just used these methods to gain over 100,000 followers, and this creator over 700,000 followers. And the same exact thing can happen to you so long as you implement every single one of these. FYI, the last one is by far the most important. Change number one is you need to start recording more videos outside. And even if you're making faceless content, you should be doing things of the outdoors. The reason for this is because the videos that are recorded outside actually get more views on Instagram than videos that are recorded within your house. And the reason for this is because it's a huge change of scenery. In fact, what I want you to do to test this, go to the Reels feed, scroll up and down, and I bet that you'll find that a lot more creators than you'd think are filming outside. And the reason for this, again, is because it increases your views. It acts as a natural hook, and then boom, people are interested because they're like, what's going going on here? I'm looking at my phone and I'm seeing outside. I need to see what comes next. Algorithm hack number two is that you need to make sure that before you go to post something on Instagram, I'm talking like right before, like five to 10 minutes before, I want you to go through, I want you to respond to old DMs, I want you to respond to old comments, and I want you to go through any new comments that you've got, I want you to go like those things. Because what all three of those actions are gonna do is it's going to notify the person on the other end that you responded or you liked. And then what's going to happen from there is they're going to come back to Instagram, they're going to see your page, and then when they go to their Instagram feed or they go to the explore feed or they go to the reels feed, guess what they're going to see? They're going to either see your latest post or they're going to see another post by you because this is how the Instagram algorithm actually works. When somebody engages with you or they engage with something you put out, boom, they end up getting shown your content. And this is one of the easiest hacks that you can implement and it only takes like five to 10 minutes right before you go to upload something. Boom, it's going to increase the reach that you get basically automatically on the next video that you post. Now, before I get into the five other hacks that you need to make sure that you're using, and by the way, the last one's the most important. I need you to smash that subscribe button. If you want to grow quicker on Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube, I literally upload a video every single day about how to grow on these platforms. In addition to that, I just created a free Instagram growth course. You can get it at the pinned comment below. It's going to share with you things like the best time to post on Instagram, the best hashtags to use, and even how to make money from Instagram with not that many followers. So what are you waiting for? Go to the pinned comment below, get into it right now. It's literally 100% free. The next hack you need to make sure that you're implementing is you need to make sure that you are putting the majority of your effort into the beginning of your video. The reason for this it's going to grab people's attention better. And let me show you a few examples of how people do this. Right here, driver going in reverse down Catawba Avenue in Cornelius. The reason that this video is getting pushed out because it's something crazy. And also, like I showed with you earlier, this video is being recorded outside. If we watch the next video, we're going to see when I left this Houston, and then again, it's going to be something that's outside. On top of that, this is a clear transition video. It's what I left and then what I come back to, and it's going to show a huge difference. If we look at this one right here, again, I finally got a white friend with the boat. This is really funny, and this is going to get sent around to anybody with a boat. On top of that, again, they're outside. Literally these first three posts that I looked at when I opened up my Instagram and started recording this are outside. And let's go to the next one. This one is inside, but what it says is me and my husband on a Friday night since we decided to start shooting up Ozempic for our health. Again, this is something that is funny. It says shooting up in here. It also says Ozempic, which are two trigger words. People really care about that or they're really against that. So guess what? This captures somebody's attention. If your post isn't capturing somebody's attention like this, well, that's why you're not getting the reach that you want. And it's why Instagram isn't pushing out your stuff. Now, the next algorithm hack that you need to make sure that you're implementing is I need you to decrease the length of your videos. Your videos need to be five seconds long, seven seconds long, 11 seconds long. And if they're longer than that, then a few things are probably happening. Either one, you're not getting to the point quick enough. Two, your thing isn't actually that funny. And three, you're ruining the emotion that somebody's actually having when they see your post on Instagram because one of two things needs to happen. And if you wait too long, well, guess what? It's going to get rid of that feeling. So if you get somebody to laugh, you need to get them to laugh immediately. If you get somebody to cry, you need to get them to cry immediately. And if you're going to teach them something, well, you need to teach them something immediately and then end right there. If you keep droning on, well, guess what's going to happen? Nobody's going to be interested. I mean, think about it like this. If you were on a date and you immediately connected with the person, but then they just wanted to keep talking and talking and talking and talking, eventually over time, it's going to make you not like that person. So what you need to make sure that you do is just leave the good stuff and then get the heck up on out of there and stop the video. And that's exactly why your video should be five, six, seven or 11 seconds long. And remember, if you're trying to teach people information, they want to learn it bit by bit. They don't want to sit there for a half an hour and watch that thing, especially on Instagram. They might want to do that on YouTube though. So if you want to talk like that, maybe post on YouTube.
Now to piggyback off of that, we have change number five. And just as a reminder, I have two more changes coming up and the last one is by far the most important if you wanna go viral in your next post on Instagram. So change number five is that Instagram is really focused on pushing out content that gets shared. And again, this kind of piggybacks off of change number four because somebody is only going to share something if it is funny, if it is really emotional, or if it's something that they think somebody else is going to find valuable or it's breaking news. And if your content doesn't hit one of those four things, it's probably not something you should be posting on Instagram. Or you need to think about how you can change the positioning of it to fit one of those four pillars. Because just creating a video the way that you want to create a video probably isn't going to get reach. Instead, you need to be focused on how the hook is and how people are going to look at it and whether or not they're actually going to share it. Now that next thing that you need to make sure is happening is you need to make sure that when you go to Instagram and you come up here and you click on your own profile, if you click on this right here, you need to make sure that these suggested accounts are going to be accounts that have something to do with your niche and have something to do with the content that you're posting. If that is not happening, then what is ultimately happening is Instagram is classifying your content the wrong way. And the way that you can fix that is by making sure that you have keywords showing in three different placements. The first place you need keywords are in your bio right here. So if we look at this guy, he tells you how to save points with your credit card. Same thing with this one. The same thing with this one. These people teach you how to change your credit. And I bet that this person has something to do with credit or finance. Yep financially free. Now, the reason is that is because that's what Nick uploads about. He uploads about credit cards. He uploads about credit repair. He uploads about just finances in general. So Instagram is classifying his content in the right way. And that's why he's been able to grow so much and make so much money from his Instagram. But if you do this for your own page and it doesn't show like this, it means you need to change what is in your bio. And you also need to change the type of content that you're uploading. In specific, there are two places that Instagram is actually looking. One in the hook of your video, does it have things related to what you're talking about. For example, Amex hacks or credit builders to boost your credit score. And then the other thing that you need to make sure of are that those keywords are also showing up in your description, because if they're not, they're going to be classifying your content the wrong way. It's going to get shown to the wrong people. You're not going to get shares. You're not going to get comments. You're not going to get people following you. And that is why you're stuck in Instagram view jail, or you might be making one of the biggest mistakes you could possibly make on Instagram right now. And that is ignoring the power of reposts. What do I mean by that? You need to make sure that you are reposting memes. You need to make sure that you are stitching other people's content. You need to make sure you're taking advantage of what is already going viral on Instagram. If you try to recreate the wheel every single time you log on to Instagram, you are not going to be successful. If you look at the most successful pages on Instagram, they repost memes. They talk about things that everybody is talking about. And they also take advantage of things that everybody is talking about. And you need to do that same exact thing in your content. And if you're struggling to do that, or you're just struggling to get followers in general, I personally want to help you. So keep watching this video because I have a really special offer for you. The opportunity to grow on Instagram and this organic reach we're currently seeing are not going to last forever. And there are two things holding you back from seeing the growth, like the creators that I share with you in this video. The first one is that you haven't implemented the tips that I just shared with you. And the second is that you haven't gotten into my Instagram mentorship program yet. That's literally going to guarantee that I help you get more followers on Instagram in the next 30 days, or you get your money back zero questions asked. In fact, the average person that's gone through this program in the last 30 days has gained over 25,000 followers and nobody has ever gone through it and gained less than a thousand followers if they implement to every piece of advice that I share with them. Now, since you're still watching this video, I'm going to assume you're probably above average. So the odds of you gaining over 25,000 followers are probably quite high. And if you want results like that, go to the link in the description below right now and sign up because there are limited spots available. I'm going to be telling you exactly what to post, when to post, what hashtags to use. I'm going to send you new post ideas and I'm going to critique your content to guarantee that you get more growth on Instagram in the next 30 days. It doesn't matter what your niche is or what your background is. This program is going to help you get followers more easily and quicker so that you don't have to spend endless hours trying to figure out the things that I already know about exactly how to grow your account. In fact, they just helped this creator in the program and they gained over 100,000 followers in just 30 days. I helped this creator, they gained over 150,000 and this creator over 200,000 followers. If you want results like that and I want you to be my next success story, go to the link in the description below and sign up right now because every single day that you wait, it's only going to get harder to grow on Instagram. It is easier than ever to grow right now, but you need to take advantage of this opportunity. And what's better than an opportunity where you're literally going to grow on Instagram or get your money back because zero questions asked. Again, there are limited spots, so go to the link in the description below and sign up right now. Otherwise, I strongly suggest you check out the next two videos I put up on the screen because they're the videos YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.